Alrighty, hey guys, this is Garrison over at Massey Toyota. And here in front of me, I've got a 2017 Toyota Camry XLE. This particular one is in the Blizzard Pearl exterior, and we do have the black leather interior. Now, your hybrid Camry can come in three trim levels. You can get an LE, an SE, or an XLE. Most of the ones we get here on the lot at Massey are going to be your XLE trims. So, coming to our window sticker, we'll check out the options we do have. As I said, 17 hybrid XLE sedan. We have the blind spot monitoring, convenience package, special color, and power moonroof, as well as carpet mats, clear paint protection, door package, and phone charger for a total of $33,752. Gas mileage is going to be a 40 in the city and 37 out on the highway. Way. Now coming to our wheels, we're riding on Bridgestone tires, and these are going to be your 17 inch alloy wheels. They're the same wheels you get on your standard XLE models. Then coming around back, we do have our single outlet chrome tip exhaust, as well as XLE hybrid badging and a rear backup camera. So we'll go ahead and step in. We do have smart key access, so just put your hand behind the door handle to unlock. And then stepping in, this particular one only has three miles on it, as you can see. So go ahead and put your foot on the brake and press your power button to start. And there's no starter hiccup noise because you are running on electric power right now. As you can see, you do have your ready um, little indication right there. So you can put it in drive and go right now if you wish. But right now, let's go ahead and check out under the hood. Now coming underneath the hood, we do have a 2.5 liter dual lever head cam inline four cylinder engine. And that is connected to Toyota's hybrid synergy drive power plant for a total combined output of 200 horsepower to the front wheels through a CVT. Now your other engine choices are going to be a 2.5 liter inline four cylinder as well as a 3.5 liter V6. So let's go ahead and check out the interior. Now before stepping in, as you can see over here in your mirror, you do have your blind spot monitoring on both sides. But coming inside, we do have the black leather interior on this model. It's going to be a fully powered driver's seat with power lumbar and as you can see you do have that nice um, gray contrast stitching right there. Now coming to your door panel, you'd have some padded upper door panel materials and, as well as a nice um, stitched accent right here, padding down in your armrest, power windows, locks and mirrors, as well as some door storage down below. Over here to the left of the steering wheel, we do have our blind spot monitoring as well as traction control off, as well as a little storage cubby. Then coming to our steering wheel, it is a three-spoke leather wrapped wheel with side bolster and grip extensions. We've got our audio as well as Bluetooth and cruise controls and, and voice commands right here. Over on the left, automatic headlights and blinkers. And then over on the right, we do have a variable intermittent speed wipers. Now, as you can see, your hybrid gauges are a little bit different than your um, regular models. Over here on the left where your tachometer would be, you do have your power gauge, which does indicate your power, eco, and then charging when you are braking. Now, your dashboard's all a nice soft touch material. It is stitched in that um, same stitching as your seats. Coming to our audio system, we'll go ahead and check out our sources. We have an AM, FM, XM, CD, USB, Bluetooth streaming audio, and auxiliary inputs. Going to apps right here, you can check out your traffic and weather, and that's through your HD radio. And so you can see your traffic right here. And then going back, we can check out our weather if you would like to. Now going home does give you a nice split screen view that you can customize. Down below here, we've got our dual zone auto climate controls with our driver and front passenger temperature. Down below that, a little storage cubby. You do have your wireless charging, as well as um, auxiliary, USB, and a 12-volt power outlet. Then here's our CVT continuously variable transmission and then putting it in reverse we do have a rear view camera right there with guidance lines. Cup holders then we do have our eco and EV modes as well as heated front seats. Nice padded and stitched armrest look inside of there another 12 volt power outlet and plenty of storage. Glove box is damped and we do have our owner's manuals as well as phone charger in there. Auto dimming review mirror with compass. Mirror and Bendy D lights on your sun visor. Then over here we do have map lights, garage home link, sunglass storage, and then controls for our power sunroof right here. So let's go ahead and check out the rear seat. So coming back here, we'll go ahead and check it out. Now as you can see, your rear seat does follow through with your black leather and contrast gray stitching. As you can see, you do have a little ventilation duct right here for your battery pack. And when this front seat set for my 5 foot 8 driving frame, I've got plenty of knee room, plenty of foot room down below. We'd have dual seat map pockets as well as rear seat vents, which is a nice touch. Over to my right, I do have a nice armrest that's padded with some cup holders. Up top, above our windows, we do also have damped cornering handles with coat hooks and some individual map lights. Now, your door materials do follow through with your contrast white stitching right here, as well as padding down in your armrest. So let's go ahead and check out the cargo area. Now coming around back, you can access your cargo area via the button inside. There's a button underneath your chrome lip right here, as well as a button on your key fob. So pressing the button right here, as you can see, we do have a nice line trunk lid with the emergency release right here. 
plenty of cargo room. Now your batteries do take up a little bit of storage, but you still do have a little pass through back there so you can drop your rear seat via this mechanism right here. Front license plate bracket right there and underneath your cargo floor you still do have your spare tire and jack. And so that'll be it for this 2017 Toyota Camry XLE Hybrid. Now, if you're interested in this vehicle or any other model out here at Massey Toyota, feel free to contact them. All their information is in the description below. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in my next video.